Setting up your i73 Pro Edge with Logic Pro on a Mac. The first step is to visit users.heritageaudio.com. Then you must log in or create a new account. Once logged in, you'll be able to access your personal space where you can manage everything related to your i73 interface. Please pay extra attention when inserting and removing the power cable. You must softly twist it into place to lock it and secure a stable connection. Also, don't forget to connect the USB cable between your interface and the computer. Here is where you can register your i73 Pro Edge. Before entering your serial number, make sure you have installed the Heritage Sync app. You can directly download it from the link in the pop-up menu. Once downloaded, launch the installer and follow the steps. Heritage Sync is the app that enables your i73 Pro Edge to communicate with the web page through your computer. Once Heritage Sync has been installed, you will need to restart your computer. Now, to add the device, you will have to enter your serial number. If there is a newer firmware version available for your i73 Pro Edge, you will be notified and given the opportunity to update it. Just follow the next steps. You might be required to turn your interface off and back on during this process. Once your unit is updated and registered, you will have access to activate your included plugins, both DSP and native. Go to All Available Software and select the plugins you wish to validate. The validation will be treated like a purchase, so once you click on Validate, they will be added to your shopping cart. Once in the shopping cart section, you will be required to log into your iLock account or create a new one. Once logged in, you will be able to complete your checkout. During this process, a native license will be deposited into your iLock account. After checkout, you will be able to activate the DSP plugins both in See All Available Software or in My Software, where you can also download the native plugins. The i73 Pro Edge is class compliant, so is plug and play but we strongly recommend downloading the Mixer software. This is easily done by going to your download section and acquiring the latest version of the Mixer available. The Mixer unlocks the full potential of your i73 Pro Edge. Check out its video to see all of its features. Here, you can insert the desired plugins per channel. In this example, we're inserting a Brit strip and quickly adjusting a few parameters to observe an obvious difference between the wet and dry channels. But before starting to use your new i73 interface, we recommend checking its calibration first. This is easily done by accessing the drop-down menu and choosing the correct output level for your setup. Now, let's configure the settings on your Mac for the audio routing. First, select your device as the input and output source. Then, set your output routing to loop back. Now, onto Logic to make the necessary adjustments. 
First, you'll need to select your i73 Pro Edge as the input and output device. Then, open an empty project and set the track inputs and outputs per channel. In this example, we're opening two tracks to show the same signal being recorded dry and wet on input channels 1 and 3. For more detailed information about the input and output routing, you can consult the user manual. Here, you'll see that the difference between the dry and wet channels are easily recognized. We hope you enjoy your i73 Pro Edge.